What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to install IBM MQ using Docker. Okay, let's get started. First, let me check what we have here. Docker. So currently I only have Postgre in my environment. Okay, so first step is to uh, let I have to shit here first step you just basically need to pull the image i actually i already installed it previously for the sake of this demo i will uh they do it again okay so so uh i'm getting error now because previously i already wait wait Docker pool, uh, error response from demo get dialing 440 with the solving host look up anyway uh, as i said i already uh, pulled the image earlier so yeah i expect to get error but not like this anyway we can check we can check if the uh, image is in our uh, pc already you can type docker images so it's here so uh yeah so the the image is already in my machine okay so basically the first time you install it you need to uh run docker pull pull command to uh pull the image okay then to check to verify whether the image is downloaded uh successfully you, you can run docker images so you will see stuff like this okay these are the images oh oh sorry sorry about that not that all only one let me check here okay ah yeah this one this one this particular is the image the size of the image is 928 mb okay so after uh they uh verify whether the image is downloaded or not uh, you can create also the volume you can run this command docker volume create um data again i already run this earlier but let me run let's see it's what will be the error but uh yeah we only run this one time only okay okay great so after creating the volume you can run this command this is a bit long but uh yeah let me explain it one by one to you yeah so basically uh yeah, of course, we accept the license and the QM manager is uh, QM1. Then the volume, the one we created earlier, QM1 data, this is the one. Then we expose two port here, one, one port, one port, and uh, 9443. This one, uh, one port, one port, this is the one our application use, this port. Then uh, 943. 9443 this is the if we want to access the console the ibm q console web console yeah you can use this the, this uh port then the detach we want uh detach we want to run the ibm mq server at the background so yeah we have to uh specify detach and the password so here we specify this password than the name of our image okay so let's run it so as the uh, uh previously this we only have two running uh how you say this uh application yeah postgre right pg container and pg admin right so after running this we expect three applications running Okay, let's run docker ps again and see whether it's up enough. Yeah, now we have uh, our IBM and Q running. Okay, so our server is running already. Now we want to verify whether it's uh, working or not. We can go to a uh, web uh, console where we use uh, this port as mentioned earlier. Uh, let's use... Uh, because uh, this is unsecured uh, portal 
So we use uh, Chrome. So localhost. This is our local. Then 943. Yeah. yeah. Basically, this is the uh, the web console of the this IBM MQ. Okay. So we will be redirected. This is unsecured. So we just proceed. Yeah. By the way, the default uh, username is admin. Then the password will be the one we specify when we install it. What is the password we use here? The password we use is password uh, zero. Password pass w zero rd. Okay, so let's use that. Pass. All right. All right. So yeah, meaning uh, we successfully install our IBM MQ server. All right. So let's uh, navigate here see uh, we can create here uh, currently we do not have any uh, yeah we have one uh, uh, um, queue manager this is QM1 yeah these are the default uh, queue name you can send message here yeah this one I, I because a while ago uh, I create I installed already and create this so yeah you can still see this because it's it's there in our volume it was uh, saved there yeah previously so yeah we have this let's see what we have how many messages oh, we don't have any messages here so yeah I think that's all for today guys uh, have a good one bye bye